These days, sanitization in the winemaking process is a topic which is becoming increasingly important. In all stages of production, grapes and wine may be subject to alterations due to unwanted yeast and bacteria. Furthermore, the presence of toxic microbial metabolites such as mycotoxins and biogenic amines may be dangerous for consumers. Meticulous hygiene in the winery during all stages of vinification, aging and bottling is fundamental for obtaining quality wine, which is free from alterations due to unwanted bacteria or yeast and for avoiding cross-contamination. The sanitization of the tanks which contain the wine, in particular those made out of wood, is a crucial stage for the entire production. In fact, bacteria, mold and yeast, such as Brithanomyces, can form in these containers. Cleansing and rinsing with chemical compounds, such as soda, is not sufficient to completely remove these microorganisms, which multiply inside. Denora, with its range of Denora Next ozonators, offers new generation, technologically advanced gaseous ozone systems and equipment, which guarantee deep sanitization. These systems exploit the properties of ozone itself, on the one hand the antimicrobial power and on the other its gaseous state, which enables it to reach and sanitize all areas that cannot be reached by traditional systems which use disinfectants diluted in water or UV or other techniques. By using a gaseous ozone system, the use of water, which must necessarily be drinking water, is significantly reduced in the production process, resulting in a reduction of costs and of the company's water footprint. A prime example of the use of gaseous ozone for sanitization is in wooden barriques and casks. Here, traditional sanitization with water and chemical compounds can be replaced by this system. It is easy to install and can be used by people who already work in the winery. L'utilizzo di sistemi d'ozono gassoso come questo consente di sanificare le botti e le barriche in profondità senza dover utilizzare acqua o sanificanti chimici allergenici come possono essere per esempio i dischetti solforosa. La cosa più interessante è che questo processo di sanificazione può avvenire anche negli strati più interni del legno in profondità dove normalmente si annida per esempio il Brettanomyces, cose che sistemi come il vapore o ancora di più come l'UV difficilmente riescono a fare. Non solo, ma un generatore come questo ha ridotti i consumi energetici, parliamo di un kilowatt, per cui rispetto a sistemi come il vapore assolutamente comporta una notevole riduzione della carbon footprint dell'azienda. Gaseous ozone is also invaluable in the sanitization process of steel tanks. L'utilizzo di sistemi che producono ozono gassoso come questo è molto interessante soprattutto per la sanificazione dei serbatoi in acciaio. Questo perché evita di dover diffondere un disinfettante con acqua, che tra l'altro è acqua potabile, e poi di dover essere risciacquato consumando ulteriormente acqua. Quindi il primo vantaggio di questi sistemi è di ridurre la water footprint di un'azienda, il consumo di acqua potabile, quindi i costi di approvvigionamento di acqua potabile dell'azienda. Inoltre, grazie ai sensori, il sistema riesce a tenere monitorato il processo di sanificazione e quindi rispetto all'uso di disinfettanti chimici io riesco anche a tenere monitorato il mio processo. Un ulteriore vantaggio è quello che non va disinfettante nell'impianto di depurazione, nelle acque di scarico e questo mi consente una più semplice gestione del mio depuratore. Treatment times vary considerably depending on the initial conditions and the size of the tank itself, from a minimum of 30 minutes up to 6 hours. Even though use is recommended on cleansed tanks to increase the effectiveness and reduce treatment times, the treatment with gaseous ozone is carried out by some wineries with excellent results, even on tanks which have simply been rinsed but not washed with chemical products such as soda. Last but not least, these systems can be employed on the rinsing machines, which are used in the normal bottling process. A winery which produces 20,000 hectoliters a year consumes on average 8,500 cubic meters of water just for washing bottles. This water, after being sprayed, is not normally reused unless it is filtered. However, the filter constitutes a critical point for the accumulation of microorganisms, which, in the event of breakage, could pollute the whole system. 
If implemented in the stages of a CIP cycle, ozone prevents recontamination of the tanks by the rinsing water. The use of gaseous ozone systems can allow for the water to be safely reused, which can lead to an almost total reduction of the volumes of water used with significant reduction of costs in economic terms and water consumption in terms of the water footprint for the environment. Gaseous ozone systems can also be used for the treatment of wastewater with the possibility of reducing the levels of COD at peak times without having to create large collection vats to increase the efficiency of the purifier and reduce the production of sludge by 30 to 40 percent with resulting advantages in economic terms. So, why use an ozone system? No use of chemical compounds. Deep sanitization. Reduction of water consumption and the quantity of water and chemical compounds which reach the purifier. Carbon footprint reduction. Reduced environmental impact. Reduction of economic costs, energy use and drinking water supply. Easy to use. Effective against biofilm. Resistant strains are not created. Automatic process, which does not require the necessary presence of operators during operation.